sports fans, and welcome to another night of Hiller Volleyballs. The Hopkinton Hillers take on the Andover Golden Warriors in the semifinal of the Division I state championship. I'm Steve Sweet up along with Mike Tarosian. Yeah, I'm glad to get out of the studio tonight. Yeah. And, you know, I was tired of you doing this alone and, and having it Tom is, fill it in is for a me. It is a little tough doing it alone. You're just talking to yourself, and I do that enough on my own. You do a very, very great job in doing that. So and the, the, the and Hillers are yep. coming in off of a 3-0 uh, sweep of Westford in the Central West Championship, and Andover coming in off a 3-2 come-from-behind victory over Methuen as well. Yeah, the Silla team is looking good, and, uh, you know, granted I wasn't at the games, but I get to see the footage as I edit it together, and, and all I can say is, wow. They came out from the get-go with their foot on the pedal, and they never let up. It was a dominating performance from the Hillers. And that's how you have to do it. You know, yep. you have to stay on them. You know, yeah, you're killing somebody. This isn't regular season stuff, you know, where you can swap the people in. you got to go in there going strong. Yep, and they did. So Andover finished first in the Merrimack Valley, coming in at 19-2 and two overall, 9-1 and one in the league. Hopkinton coming in. 21 and 2 overall, 14 and 1 in the Tri Valley League. And, the, and we're going to cut away here and uh, as the girls enter, and we'll be back when we get underway. Okay. Coaches and contest officials have worked diligently to prepare for tonight's competition. Please show your appreciation by demonstrating good sportsmanship and respect for all in attendance. Ensure that your behaviors reflect the values that should be identified with these student athletes. Assume responsibility for your behavior and the behavior of those around you. If you require assistance, please call upon NIAA school or security official. Any verbal or physical conduct related to race, gender, ethnicity, disability, sexual orientation, or religion shall not be tolerated and could subject the violator to ejection and may result in penalties being assessed against your team. <coughs> At this time, I'd like to introduce the visiting team, Andover High School. <laughs> Number 12, Cindy Bergen. Number seven, Angie Grabheim. 
Number nine, Jenna Wilwood. Number 10, Mia Ardilla. Number 11, Ivy Ivy. Number 12, Cecily McEnroe. Number 13, Rachel Zale. Number 14, Allison Lover. Number 15, Bella Onsi. And number 16, Ashley McDermott. Hockey Dinner Managers are Kate O'Connor and Kayla Toll. She's assisted by Mary Bransfield and the Sweet Apple, Tina Slippin, and Mike Miller. Tonight's officials will be Brad Frost, Maureen Hamnadian, line judges Bill Burkholz and Mark Burick, and at the scores table, Glenn Corwin and Brian Gilbrega. persevered through the leadership and sacrifices of men and women who have served or are currently serving in our armed forces. We invite all the veterans and current military personnel to stand. for set number one here. Coming to you from the Algonquin Gymnasium, the Division I semi state semifinals, Hopkinton against Andover. Should be a very good match, Mike. Yeah, I'm actually, I'm looking forward to this. This is, uh, this is the level. This is, this is what they're here for, the Division yep. I. This is why they work so hard in all their years to get to. Uh, they proved that they can compete in it. Now you're at the state level. And uh, this is what they played for right here, These two, this game here tonight. So out there on the floor for the Hillers, we've got Amanda, Rachel, Ivy, Jill, Angie, Allison, and Jess. Jess will check in momentarily for Jill. <coughs> and Andover will start serving based on Hopkinton's formation. Yeah, in the front for Andover, it looks like Sydney Bergen, Sophia Wang, uh, Haley Halverson, you have uh, Sarah Shattuck, Olivia Gaspar, and finally number 16, Alexis Mancha. And back to serve for Algonquin. It looks like it's going to be Olivia Gaspar. And Olivia Gaspar will get us underway here. And just couldn't handle that first serve. Very unjust like. She was there, just not enough height. Okay. Amanda, Rachel, back set to Angie. Grab Meyer, long. Two zero, and over in front. Yeah, a little long. They gotta, they gotta get their feel for the gym. Amanda gets that to Rachel. Back to Gilbert, straight down the line. 
Nice kill from Gilbert. Grabmeyer back to serve. Two to one. Andover in front. Nice deep serve from Angie. Allison hits the floor, Grabmeyer goes to Gilbert, cross court. Andover with a back set, tipped. Allison gets that, Angie goes outside to Rachel, down the line. Nice job by Andover. Jess gets under that, Rachel. No, it went to Ivy in front. I thought it was going back set. Jess, Angie, Rachel just pumps it over. Nice save, Angie. Jess keeps it alive. Great play from Meller. And there's a block kept alive, Rachel. Angie with a back set to Gilbert, goes cross court, blocked. Four hits. Four hits. I thought there was a tip. I thought it was a tip as well. Great rally. This is the kind of action I think we're going to see all night. Yep, I agree. Meredith Hunt to serve. Angie gets to that. Rachel, Jess from the back line, and that's out. Jess just hit it wide. Four to one, Andover in front here in the first set. How can a kid only four to give a couple more of those away? So they have to get their adjusting done now. Meller gets under that. Rachel, back to Grabmeyer, tipped. Outside, and that's wide. Good eyes from Allison. Much needed side out for Hopkins. Yep. Four to two. Hiller's trailing by two. Nice serve. Good Block. luck. Here's a free ball for Rachel. Nice play from Zale. Four to three, Hiller's trailing by one here in the first set. Another good serve from Gilbert. Andover, thumps it deep. Angie with the set, outside to Lorette, cross court. Back to Lorette, double hit. Oh, Angie. Carry. Yep. Side out, side out to Andover. It didn't have that sound of a double hit here. Jess, good receive of serve. Angie with nice. a quick thump over. Well played. Nice fake that played off well. Yep. Jill checking in for Ivy. Jess back to serve. Hopkinton trails by one. Nice serve from Jess. Oh, great save from Angie. And oh, Allison just hit it long. Great save from Grabmeyer. Rolling across the net like that, you're lucky to get a hand on it. It was a super save. Emily Nason checking it for Andover now. She goes back to serve. Six to four, Andover in front. Allison receives that well. Short set, great, great downward hit. Yeah, even though she uh, placed that shot right at the feet of Meredith Hunt, Meredith Hunt just wasn't able to give it back. Nope, Jill hit that with some authority. Zale back to serve. Oh, long. Playable, but smart move. Yep. Smart move on Andover's part. Mia was, uh, checks in for Rachel. That was Sophia Wang with a good eye on that. Sarah Shattuck serving. Oh, unforced error from Andover. That's what the Hillers needed for a side out. Shack just hit it a little late. She had a good approach, just a little late hit. Set that right in the net. Allison Lorette back to serve. There's a free ball. Lorette gets under that. Mia. 
outside to Gilbert. Nice put away from Amanda. Gilbert slid and it took advantage of that little bit of space between uh, Shattuck and, and Nason. Tied up at seven. Lorette gets under it again. Mia goes back set to Wilworth. Girls have a free ball here. Jess, Mia, short set. Nice again from Jill. Well, she made that look like she was going cross court. Yep. Stayed on our side of the net to get hit. That was great. Eight to seven, Hillers in front. Oh, friendly net. That's a difficult way to get an ace. Right, and you can't hit that ball any lower. Any lower, it is going into the net and staying on your side. That crawled up and over. Lorette sends it deep. And there's a there's double a hit. Oh, double hit. You must have heard it. I didn't hear it. <laughs> and Coach Bergen takes her first time out here as Hopkinton starting to put a little distance between themselves and Andover with a three-point lead. Right, and it, you know, a three-point lead is, is unusual for a, um, for a timeout, but it is definitely needed here where they had, uh, you know, what, about six, seven unanswered points. Yep. So I think, uh, I think Grabmeyer is, uh, Grabmeyer is probably telling, telling the girls now, listen, you, you got it, stick with it. The other team saying, hey, I think they figured us out, we got to change up. Yep. Hopkins just needs to cut out the unforced errors. Right. Keep the ball in play. So out there on the floor, we've got a front row of Jill, Amanda, and Jenna. Jenna and then yeah. Mia, Jess, and Allison in the back row with Lorette serving. 10-7, Hopkinton in front here in the first set. Another nice nice serve from Allison. Oh, and great the block. House. The roof. Jill Putty picking up where she left off in the uh, sectional final. She, had a she and Ivy both had a tremendous game defensively at the net. Allison keeps that serve deep. Cross court. Oh, that hit the antenna. Nice point for the Hillers. Hopkinton opening up a five-point lead. Back row hit and miss hit from Andover. Wang with the paintbrush. Yep. Giving these points back to Hopkinton is going to be their downfall right now. They need to make every hit count. Lorette with another great serve. Jess with a diving oh. arm bar. Mia keeps it alive. Oh, nice point from Andover. Got it once, couldn't do it twice, but wow, did she was able to con it back and keep it in play. Great hustle from both teams. Alexis Mancha serving. One of the three tri-captains. Lorette to Mia. Back set to Jenna. Tipped at the net, kept alive by Andover. And oh. nice, nice placement. Just inside, H Haley Halverson just found the line. 13 to nine, Hillers in front. Girls need a side out here. Nice serve, handled well by Jess. Mia, Allison from the back line. Andover coming from the back line. Jess hits the floor again, gets it to Mia. She goes outside to Amanda. And Andover, nice hustle, but a nice point for the Hillers. Sarah Williams with a great effort trying the kick save. Yep, she I, did. I, I don't think we've seen that this year. No. Haven't seen a kickball yet. Nope. Seen one off the head, but that's yep. it. Bella Ansi checks in, and she's going to go back to serve. Oh, Bella sends it long. Side out Hillers. 
Yeah, playable. Or out at, Andover. Yeah, playable at the head of uh, Nason, but she uh, she knew where she was standing and it was going out. Gasper to serve. Allison receives that well. Mia goes outside to Gilbert. Blocked. Allison keeps Big it alive. Block. Jess back to Gilbert. And a nice <laughs> smart play. They were expecting a thunder They were clap. expecting the thunder, and instead they got the little poof. Yep. <laughs> Nicely done from Gilbert. Grabmeyer back to serve. Hopkinton back in front by five. And another paintbrush, Mike. Yep. Sydney Bergen. Nice 16 10 lead here. Yep. Angie with another knuckleball. Ooh, great back row hit. Wow. Jess. Allison gets it over. Well done. I, I, you know, that hard hit, Andover decided to stay flat footed, thinking they weren't going to save it. They wound up saving it. The yep. flat footedness caused Andover to to lose the point. Great hustle from Allison and Jess on that point. Grabmeyer hits it to the back row again. Allison. And net, net violation. violation. 18 so to 10. Sophia Martinez for Andover. Hopkinton opening up its largest lead of the match. And Andover calls their second and last timeout. A little early, I think, but uh, you know, there's your eight-point spread that you see during regular season for a timeout. Yep. But uh, they're not they're not answering back, and so again, I'm sure uh, that coach uh, Jane Bergen is, is giving them the right advice to handle them for the rest of the set. Yep. Whether or not it's, they're going to succeed, it seems like uh, anytime they try to adjust, Hopkinton is right there to answer. Yeah, after the first five or six points were played, the Hillers seem to have settled down and they're, they've found their groove now. Right, you know, your first time playing in the court, you only get seven minutes of warm-up. And, yeah, I think they I think they handled it quite well. You know, I, I tell you, I don't like the orange line. I'm, I'm actually feeling it in my eyes right now. Well, the, the positive there is you can see the line. I can't see the line. That's right. When that ball was in, I called it in before the flag went down. So... <laughs> It is, it is obnoxious. It is, very much so. And we're ready to get back underway. Grabmeyer serving. Angie floats another one to the back row. Back set, blocked at the net. And Ivy with a nice put away. Halverson was there, but she's there by herself, no help. Yep. Nineteen to ten, Hillers in front. Grabmeyer hits that back row consistently. Oh, oh, that was long. And Rachel, great hustle from the back row again. Yeah, you know, it, it was definitely play playable. It was definitely going out. You play it. Yep. You know. Yep. You got to play it. Side out to the Golden Warriors. Meredith Hunt back to serve. Andover trailing by eight. Angie hits the floor. Ivy, nice swing, kept alive by Andover. Again from the back row, and four hits. Side out Hillers. Gilbert back to serve. 20 to 11. Outside set. Oh, that one kind of handcuffed Jess. Side out, and, side out, and over. Sophia Wang to serve. Amanda gets to that. Middle set to Ivy, just taps it over. Good reflex from Andover. Amanda gets to that. Angie goes outside to Lorette. Allison with a nice swing. Andover pushes it out wide. And that's on the line. 
Good point from Andover. Gilbert settles under that. Angie with a back set. Oh, double hit. Yeah, it didn't look like uh, oh, carry. a carry. That's two of them on Angie. That gets in your head after a while, too. Amanda, Angie, middle, Ivy, again, just tips it over. Didn't look like Ivy was ready for that. Oh. Hopkins had had the block set up, but it snuck between Ivy and Rachel. Yeah, Alexis Rancher was able to punch that hard. 20 to 15. Amanda, Angie, dumps it over. Andover was ready for it this time. This is low. Angie, Jess, outside to Lorette. Blocked. Oh, nice try from Amanda. Andover within four, and Coach Grabmeyer calls a timeout. Yeah, smart move. Smart move is they're creeping back. So the winner of this match will play Saturday at 5 o'clock at uh, Worcester, right? Worcester State at 5 p.m. And it's the, well, I believe it's 5 p.m. It usually yeah. goes 3, 2, and 1. So I'm guessing uh, 5 p.m. Worcester State, and that's the winner of Barnstable. Barnstable. Or Born, yeah, Barnstable versus uh, Born. Newton North. Oh, Newton North, right. Yep. And that game is going on right now in Taunton. Yeah, I'll be checking the Twitter, see if there's anything uh, to be said there. That was the one common opponent that these two teams had was Barnstable. Barnstable, right. Andover lost 3-0 and Hopkinton lost 3-1. So this is the, the top four teams in the state actually are where they're supposed to be. Andover right at four, belong. Hopkinton exactly. at three, there Newton North at two, and Barnstable at one. Yeah, there was no upsets, nothing, uh, no anomalies. <laughs> Each team has used the timeout in this set. Or no, Andover's used both. Hopkins Andover's still has both. one. Yep, Hopkins, one left. Rotation. Rotation violation. And no argument from Coach Grabmeyer. That's long. And that's out. Wow, that looked a lot longer, but man, that was close to the line. It, it took a while to come down. Sure did. Some serious hang time. Side out to the Hillers. 21-17, Jill checks in. Oh, Jess with a diving arm bar. Jill sends that over. And nice put away. That was Sarah Shattuck. Yeah, Shattuck was Shattuck. there. Yeah, she found that opening in the floor. And her eyeballs were right on it when she hit it. 21-18, side out to Andover. Let's see if the girls can get a quick side out here. Jess, Angie, Rachel, oh, nice block. Nobody was there from the Hillers to fill that hole. Yeah, Alexis Mancha, yeah, she saw that. And they were able to put that block right on it. Back set to Zale, tipped, and Andover can't handle that. Good side out. Zale back to serve. Rachel had a great run of service in the uh, sectional championship game. Twenty-two, nineteen. Hillers in front. Just gets to that outside to Allison. Tipped at the net. Here's a free ball. Jenna. Yeah, man, Tata. Yep. 
Good point for the Hillers. Smart play from Jenna. Double hit. Double hit. Yes. And so we got set point here. <laughs> Down the line, there's an ace to take the first set. Great serve from Rachel. Hopkinton takes that first set 25 to 19. The girls are going to switch sides. We'll take a quick break and we'll be right back. Have you ever considered texting and driving? If so, you should know the consequences. If caught texting and driving for the first time, you could get an $100 fine plus your license taken away for 60 days. The consequences only get worse the more you get caught. Even if you don't get caught, there could be serious effects. You could get into a car accident and hurt yourself or someone else. Texting and driving is a very dangerous combination, so stop before this happens to you. And we're back for set number two here in the uh, Division I semifinals. Steve Sweetup along with Mike Tarosian and Tom Dings manning the camera. Thank you, Tom. So out there on the floor for the Hillers, got a front row of Amanda, Rachel, and Ivy. Back row of Angie, Jill, and Allison. Jess will check in for Jill. And Angie will go back to serve. Hopkinton took the first set 25 to 19. A pretty entertaining set, Mike. It was definitely entertaining, and I'd love to give you stats, but I don't think at the state levels we get the stats from the managers. The only stat that matters is Hopkinton had 25 points. I and like Andover that. Andover didn't. Yes. That is fine by me. Yep. First set started out a little, little wonky, but the girls settled in. Yeah, you know, you get a minute to get used to the floor. It seems like that uh, Andover uh, got used to the floor first. But uh, Hopkinton adjusted after six points, and, and the rest was them. And there's Jess checking in. Angie with the ball, and we'll get the second set underway. Nice deep serve from Grabmeyer. Girls will have a free ball here. Jess settles under that, gets it to Angie. She goes right in the middle to Ivy, and that's long. Side out, Andover. Sophia Wang to serve. Jess, a little bit of a miss hit. Tipped. Do nothing. Andover out in front. Yeah, early she, in went, the second in, she step. went in the middle, but not enough to uh, to make it away from the net for us to hit it, and that's going in the net. And side out, Hopkinton. Jess will go back to serve, or no, I'm sorry, Amanda, serving. Nice serve from Gilbert. Ivy, Angie, back set, Zale, into the wow. net. Huge block by Shattuck, huge. Side out, Golden Warriors. Emily Nason checks in, she'll go back to serve. Andover with a two point lead here in the, first, in the second set. Lorette. Grabmeyer back to Lorette. Allison, nice, powers it through the block. Side out, Hopkinton. Jill checks in. Just back to serve. Jess floats a short one in. Back set. Oh, nice block from Jill, but just pushed it wide. Just push it, yeah. Shattuck to serve. Ahead of fun rotation. Back to Lorette. Down the line. That was long. That was long. 
No one got a hand on it. Short set to Ivy, or to Jill. Great play from Sarah Pusco. Side out Hillers. Zale to serve. And that's out. Good eyes from Jenna. Hopkinton down by one. Zale hits the back row. Back set. Tipped, blocked by Jill. Another block from Jill, kept alive by Andover. Amanda. Oh, nice hustle from Allison. She hits the bench. Mia checks in for Rachel. Mancha to serve. Hopkinton trails by two. Lorette. Mia bumps it outside. Well, great swing from Jenna. Side out, side out Hopkinton. Block kept alive by Mia. Oh, nice size from Andover. Side out, Golden Warriors. Gaspar to serve, seven to five. Andover in front. Gilbert to Mia, back to Amanda, and that's long. Too many unforced errors here from the Hillers. Mia, Jenna's just gonna have to pump that over. And that's long, side out. Ivy checks in, as well as Bella Ansi. Ansi back to serve. Hillers trail by two here in the second set. Hopkinton took the first set, 25 to 19. Nice serve from Ansi. Back set to Andover, blocked. Hopkinton couldn't control it though. Side out, Andover. Jess checks back in. Meredith Hunt back to serve for Andover. Three point lead here for the Golden Warriors. Allison to Mia, bump set, Amanda. Jess gets to that, Mia. Back set to Wilworth. Nice, nice put away from Jenna. Zale and Grabmeyer check in. Mia and Jenna will depart. Grabmeyer back to serve. Angie gets to that. Jess, that's gonna be short. Side out to Andover. Wang back to serve. Rachel with a bump set. Amanda just hits it over. And that's out. Good eyes from Jess. Heads up play. Gilbert back to serve. And neither team has been able to string together a run of points here, Mike. No, a lot of a lot of back and forth, which neither team likes. They like to get that push ahead so they can give away that one side out once in a while. Good swing, great defense from Gilbert to Lorette, blocked. Oh, great block at the net from Shattuck. Side out, Andover.
Oh, that's just out. I thought for a second Allison was going to reach for it, but she stopped just in time. Just back to serve. Amanda, Angie, back set to Zale. Good power, nice placement from Zale. Hopkinson within one. Zale still continuing with her tradition of finding that open spot on the floor. Yep. Back set, and that's long. And we're tied up at 11. Now Jess needs to just pull off a couple more points here. Build up a nice little cushion. Ooh, nice play. Great serve from Jess. That's what we expect from her all the time, mixing them up. You either gotta get a nice rope that's going to the backcourt, or you gotta get a little daisy duke, a little over, over the top. Cooperate. Oh, yeah, she was. She was going for the rope close to the net. Yep. <laughs> Tied up at 12, side out and over. Shattuck back to serve. Jess gets under that. Angie goes outside to Allison, goes down the line. It was Ooh. tipped. I thought it was tipped. I thought it was tipped too. No? Apparently not. 13 to 12, and over in front. Have to check that tape later. Yep, I thought it was tipped. Jess settles under that. Short, quick set. Blocked. Oh, great arm bar from Jess. Zale cross court. Kept alive by Andover. Amanda. Angie. Not much Rachel can do with that. Just pops it over. Angie. Rachel. It's going outside to Lorette. And nice play from Allison. Good placement. Great placement, miss hit by Sarah Williams. All comes together, ties and things up. Jenna checks in, Zale back to serve. <laughs> Jess, Rachel. Jenna, nice cross court, great defensive arm bar from Wang. And from the back row, and that's long. 14-13, Hopkinson in front. And Andover calls a timeout. I'm gonna assume that was the first timeout because I was busy fixing headphones. Yes, it, it <laughs> was. <laughs> okay. It is the first timeout taken. Yeah, good, good time for uh, a timeout Yep, for them. Neither team really been able to open up much of a lead here in the second set, so. Hopkinson with a one point lead here, but they've been playing better. Yeah, I, I, see, I, see, uh, I see that Andover has adjusted very well. Uh, again, but what you said, it's a lot of back and forth. Neither team has the time to, to do those offensive plays to uh, to really score some points and stretch out a league. Everything is so back and forth. And it's a lot of, I mean, you get everything too from little miss hits <laughs> to great saves that just keeps it keeps sending the uh, points back and forth. Yep, both, uh, both teams are playing very well, fairly evenly matched. No big mistakes, nope. you know, no big mistakes. So Zell will get the second set back underway. Looks that one to the back row. Tipped. Amanda gets under that. Rachel to Lorette. Good approach from Allison. Goes cross court. Tipped. <laughs> nice point for Andover. Side out, tied at 14. Mia checks in. Rachel goes out. And Mancha back to serve. Allison, Mia. Ooh, nice recovery from Jenna. That was supposed to be a set to the middle. Went too long, and that's long. Good point for the Hillers. Side out. 
Yeah, that or that was a new fake that uh, that they were showing off it was that a, yeah. we didn't know about. we never seen before. The fake was executed. The, uh, yeah. the, the, the kill wasn't. <laughs> Jess gets under that. Mia pushes it outside to Gilbert. That's going to be tough. Oh, they keep it alive. Jess, see if they go back to Amanda. Nope. Quick dump over for Mia. Andover was ready for it. Tipped. Allison, Mia, back to Gilbert. Mia, outside to Jenna. Nice play from Wilworth. Great cross court kill. Now that time they did execute the decoy in the middle. Lorette with another deep serve. Allison hits the floor defensively. Down the line, Gilbert. Oh, this could be trouble. Yep. Nice point for the Hillers. Hopkinton opening up a three-point lead here late in the second set. And there's an ace for Allison. Nice. Andover was flat-footed there. Hopkinton's biggest lead of the set right now. And double paintbrush. Yep. Ho oh. ho. You don't usually see that. No. Nope. I think I called one or two during the season. That was about it. And Andover uses their second timeout. Hawkington's opened up a five-point lead here late in the second set. And you got to tip your hat to Coach Grabmeyer. She's built an impressive program here, starting out in Division Three for a couple years, moved up to Division Two for about a dozen years, and now first two, year in. Two state champions in two, yep. and then. Uh, first year in Division first One. First year in one, and then already at the semifinals. Yep. Coach Millard coaches the eighth grade team. Yep. Coach Pacific, undefeated freshman team this year. Right. Coach Sweet Apple, my favorite volleyball player of all time. Yes. Coaching the JVs, and then yeah, Mary Bransfield. You guys Bransfield. know each other, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mary Bransfield uh, assisting Margie. Great addition to the uh, squad when she came on uh, three years ago as assistant. So out there on the floor, we've got Amanda, Jenna, and Jill in the front row. Mia, Jess, and Allison in the back. Allison to serve. 1914, Hillers in front. Came close to another double paintbrush there. Jess settles under that. Mia with a short set. Sarah Pusco. There it is. That's the one we're all familiar with right there. Six point lead for the Hillers. Lorette, another great serve. Oh, great recovery from Jill. Oh, just short. Nice try from the Hillers. Side out and over. Gaspar back to serve. Bump set to Jenna into the net. That was a little low. Twenty to sixteen, Hopkinton in front here in the second set of this Division I semifinal. Mia, nice tip over from Jill. Allison gets to that. Mia goes outside to Amanda. Nice defensive play from Andover. Back set to Jenna. Oh, great nice. swing from Wilworth. Side out Hopkinton. Bella and Ivy checking in. And Bella will go back to serve. 21-16, Hillers in front.
Good serve from Ansi. Back set. And that's long. Point Hillers. Just like we seen in the first set, Steve, the starting a little bit of a meltdown. Yep. Bella floats that to the back row. Nice play from Ivy. She entered the DMZ, just got her palm on the ball. Great block. For the uh, younger audience, you have to Google that. Two point, Hopkinton two points away from taking the second set. Yeah, we are showing our age, aren't yes, we? Yes, we are. Bella, Mia, oh, that's gonna be tough. Amanda couldn't oh, do much with that Oh, kept inside the antenna, but yeah. yeah. Yeah, she was able to swing it this side of the antenna, yeah. but gonna stop the momentum into net. Yeah, the set was too far forward. Jess checks back in. Side out and over. Meredith Hunt serving. Hopkinton in front by six. Jess, Mia, Allison from the back row. Jess, Mia, goes back to Gilbert. And that's no. blocked wide, point Hopkinton. Side out Hillers, Zale checks in. Grabmeyer checks in. Angie goes back to serve at set point. Set point for set number two. Grabmeyer. And there's a block. Kept alive. Lorette settles under that. Angie, back set. Zale, great power. Should be a free ball. And a net violation. There's the second set. Hopkinton takes that 25-17. Girls are going to switch sides. We'll take a quick break and we'll be right back. This week on From the Vault, PAW's Who's Next? A 1998 wrestling show hosted by Dave Pilot and Jeff Wharton featured a dozen wrestlers that competed in backyards and wrestled on trampolines. Pace is just too big. The referee has spent more time with Superfly than watching the match. And, and what just happened there? Look at this. Destruction won't tag him, and this oh. allows Cactus to get a nice submission hold on. And he pulls the arm back to keep her from tagging now. And we're back for set number three here in the Division I state semifinal. Andover against Hopkinton. Hopkinton took the first set 25-19 and the second set 25-17. And uh, one piece of news from Coach Grabmeyer, Mike, is that two of the girls made the Massachusetts All-State Volleyball team, and that would be Rachel Zale and Jess Meller. Congratulations, Congratulations. to the girls. Congratulations, not surprised in the least bit. I mean, I would like to see more, but yeah, you know, they got spread it out. That's the second time uh, the girls, that the, the team has had two All-State representatives yes. back in uh, 2014, Holly Adams and Hannah Engstrom. Hannah Engstrom, right. So in the last uh, seven years, Hopkinton has had at least one state player represented. Only started in 2010. The only year that they haven't since then is 2011. So once again, it just shows the, the strength of the program that Coach Grabmeyer program. has built. Program is fantastic. It's, you know, you, you don't want to say dynasty, but I mean, the program itself is just, it just feeds. Yep. Eighth grade, you start. And right. you just belong. And it's the effort the girls put in, too. I mean, when the season ends, so the vast majority of them play clubs. So the girls True. put in a tremendous amount of, uh, of time, effort, and uh, it shows on the court. And they're also staying involved with the younger players, a big sister, little sister. Yep. yep. You know? Yep. A lot I mean, of clinics put on. Yep. And so we're underway here in set number three, Gasper to serve. Allison gets to that. Rachel, outside set. Gilbert goes cross court. Bumped over by Wang. Allison, Rachel, Amanda. Ivy gets to that. Well done. Grabmeyer, it's blocked. Big block. Lorette hits the floor. Outside to Gilbert. Nice hustle from Andover. Ivy. A double hit from Rachel. 
Jess was calling that for that. Right. Super rally. Super rally there. Yep. Good point. Jess, good receive. Rachel to Ivy. Tipped at the net. Andover keeping it alive. Back set. That was going to be trouble right from the get-go. Yeah, big miss hit. Side out, Hillers. Tied up at one. Grabmeyer to serve. Boy, Angie's consistently been hitting that back row with the serves. So has. Allison, Angie, Zale, cross court deep. Nice defense from Andover. Nice That's put tough. away. Halverson with a nice put away down the line for a side out to Andover. Meredith Hunt back to serve. Two to one, Andover in front here early in the third set. Angie, oh, with a miss hit there. I usually see that from the sophomore. Two in a row from Angie. I thought for sure she was going to let it go. I, thought, I think she was thinking, is it, is it going to go long or not? Amanda, Rachel, Jess from the back row. And nice swing from Jess. <laughs> she gives a yeah. arm thrust. I tell you, much needed side out after those two errors. Yep. Gilbert back to serve. Four to two. Hopkinton trails. Nice serve from Gilbert. Showing the senior leadership there. Another great serve from Gilbert. Tied up at four. Yeah. Ando has had a problem all afternoon. Those types of serves that are close to the net that make it all the way to the back row. Another good serve. And nice put away. It was Sydney Bergen. Side out Andover. Wang to serve. Could be a free ball here. Nope. Allison, Angie, down the middle. Ivy tipped. Oh. 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 <laughs> just, just, got a hand yeah, just, just got a fingertip to it. 6 4, and over in front. Wang to serve. And nice swing by Rachel into the block, but pushed wide. It was a good run of serves from Wang. So once again, dating herself. Is that everybody Wang Chung tonight? Yes. No one will get it? Yeah, no one will get it. Not for sure. Well, except the younger the, crowd. Except the coach and maybe a family out in Ohio. <laughs> Jess floats that one in. Angie, outside to Lorette, and off the top of the net and in. Tied up at six. Let's see what Jess does with this. And she's done a nice job of mixing mm -hmm. up her serves tonight. Tipped, go, oh, kept alive by Jill, well done. Allison's just gonna thump that over. Middle. Nice point for Andover. Seven to six. Golden Warriors in front. Mason back to serve. Sends that one short. 
Hopkinson was flat footed. Oh, nice play from Allison. Blocked, well done. Jill puts the Big roof house. on that. Big house. That's such an exciting play when it's a well-struck ball and the block is put on perfectly. Zale with the serve. Jess, nice dig. Wilworth. She thumped that. Well played, though, by Wang. Jess hits the floor again. Allison, blocked. Nice play from Andover. Shattuck with a great play in the middle. Andover looking really good right now. Two-point lead for Andover here in the third set. Division I state semifinal match. Coming to you from Algonquin High School. Jess, Mia, outside to Jenna with the oh, authority. Chester. Yep. Jenna, see if they go back to her. She's hot. Nope. They go to and double hit. Three point lead for Andover. And uh, into the net. We'll take it. Yep. Good set out for the girls. Hopkinson down by two. Allison to serve. Jess, Mia pushes it outside. Gilbert with authority. Nice put away from Amanda. Nice serve from Allison. A little confusion here from Andover, but they keep it alive. Mia, Wilworth, ooh, just out. It was a good angle Jenna took, just Great a angle. little long. Yep. Side out Andover. Allison settles under that, Mia, Outside to Gilbert. Jess to Amanda, just pushes that one over. Good tip. Well nice done. Nice save. Great defense from the Hiller. Oh, who had the double hit? I think Allison had the double hit. I disagree. That's why I don't have a whistle in my mouth, though. And a white shirt. Oh, foot, that was a foot fault. The ref didn't even look. No, nope. supposed to watch that serve go off. Nice yeah. play from Jill. Yeah, that was a full, full front of the toes were over the line. Bella Ansi checks in. She'll serve. Hopkinton trails by two. Nice, a nice Bella. Serve. Good ace. Woke up a fan who was texting. Uh, volleyball reporter, to the head. Reporter, I'm sure he's getting his stories in. Nice serve from Monty again. Allison, Mia, Jenna. Down the line. Perfect from Jenna. Side up at 12. Yeah, Shattuck did not like that call. She was there too, but so was our line judge. Bella gets to that. Mia outside to Gilbert. Blocked wide. Point Hillers. Hawkington 13-12, out in front, and Andover takes a timeout there. Wow. Coach Bergen is 
seen their her team's lead evaporate. Yeah, well, she. I mean, they 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 have to stay alive here, and I right. understand that. Kind of early for a timeout, but you know what? She don't want this lead to get away. They've been back and forth all night, uh, all set. They want to keep it close. Oh. oh, oh! Thank you, Karen. Karen Cooprider just giving us an update that Barnstable Basketball's trails. Basketball's down two to zero. Two to zero. Yeah, that's awesome. So. Even, even the Metro guest guys looked at. Wow, really? <laughs> Holy cow! This could be uh, a fun Saturday. So thirteen to twelve, Hillers in front. Ansi serving. See if Bella can. Continue this impressive run here. Front row of Amanda, Jenna, and Ivy. Allison, Mia, and Bella in the back row. This is about where the first two sets where the Hillers started to pull away, so. Hansi with another deep serve. This could be trouble. Great block, kept alive, another free ball. And it looked like a little confusion there, but uh, it pays off well for the Hillers. Bella. Wang hits that deep, Hansi under it again. Mia, outside set to Gilbert. And a great, great hit from Amanda. 15 to 12. Hopkinton starting to put a little distance here between themselves and the Golden Warriors. Good knuckleball from Bella. Short set, blocked. That was the okay. Ivy think, show. Yeah, I'll have you right there. 16-12. Lorette. Oh, that was a whistle. Uh, net violation on uh, Jenna. Jenna. All right, I thought that was a, a sneaker squeak. I did too. Yeah. Gasper to serve. Andover trails by three here in the third set. Hopkinton took the first two sets. Allison, Mia, Ivy. Ooh. There was an elbow on Andover that hit the net. Jenna, nice, on the line. Good. Side out, Hillers. Rachel and Angie check in for Mia and Jenna. Angie will go back to serve with a four point lead. Jennifer McNaughton checking into the back row from for Andover. Oh, Lorette hits the floor again. Angie, bump set, grab my, or to Amanda in the net. Little, time to, just a little bit off. Yep. Side out, Andover. Three point lead for the Hillers. Meredith Hunt back to serve. Jess gets to that. Rachel, Ivy, blocked. Shattuck with a nice block in the middle. Seventeen, fifteen. Hillers in front. Angie. Jess just thumps that deep. And into the net again by Andover. Sydney Bergen again with a unforced error. Gilbert back to serve. Hillers back in front by three. Oh, 
And there's an ace for Gilbert. 19-15. Imagine if the Hillers get another point here, Mike will see a timeout. Definitely. Oh, that's oh. long. Good eye. Yeah, McNaughton with a quick pullback of the hands at the last second. Wang to serve. Amanda. Oh. Wow. Yep. Wow. Sophia Martinez with <laughs> What it. an ugly point. Yep. Ivy and Bella depart. Jill checks in, Meller to serve. Amanda, Angie, back set, Zale, cross court. Nice hustle from Andover. Angie, Rachel, going cross court. Lorette goes wide. And Point Hillers sends the score table diving. Score table flashing, scorekeeper ducking. 21-16, Hillers. Jess hits the back row again. Blocked. Kept alive by Andover. Great block from Jill. And that's wide. Oh, tipped. Yep, that violation. Net violation, number seven. So 17. Yeah. 17. 22 16. Surprised we didn't get a timeout there. Coach Bergen did not like that call. Oh! oh. There was a big opening oh. there. Jess was going for it, but yep. into the net. Side out and over. That's a chance you take with those liners, yeah. you know? It was a big open area. And she's been hitting the uh, short serve all night. Ooh, that handcuffed Amanda. Allison, good job defensively, girls keeping it alive. Rachel. And Amanda just couldn't control that. Well, shanked up to the cheap seats over here at Hopkins side. Twenty-two eighteen. Pillars in front. Jess, Angie, Rachel cross court, sharp angle. And oh, nice save from Andover. No, nope. oh. No, nope, it was outside the antenna. Side out Hillers. Yeah, they say they can't see it, but he's in a spot for it. So Hopkinton's two points away from match point. <laughs> Andover fans are not happy. And we are real close to him. Yes. You're closer. Yeah, thanks. You're my wall. And there we are. Set point, match point. <laughs> Hopkinton one point away from moving on. To there you go, one point away. State match finals. point. State semifinal. Jenna able to keep that alive. Great point Nobody though from Shattuck. Alive. So we got one more. 24-19. Shattuck back to serve. Hiller still at set at match point. Oh, that's the match. Shattuck wow. put a little too much juice on that one. A little too much mustard, I like to say. Yep. There so you go. Hopkinton takes the uh, third set, 25-19 for a 3-0 sweep. 
pretty impressive, Mike. I was very impressed by that. Great play by Andover the whole game. Good, and, but just better play by the Hillis. Yep, they, Hopkinton uh, started out a little slow in the first set, but once they got uh, the first six or seven points behind them, um, fairly dominant play from the girls. Excellent. All three sets were close until about 10 points, and then the yep. Hillers just started to uh, separate themselves there. So they were going to play Friday, or excuse me, Saturday. Saturday at Probably around 5 o'clock at Worcester, you, yep. Worcester State. Check the HCAM website. Yep. It'll be posted there. And, uh, we'll be there. We will be there, and uh, not sure who they're going to be playing. It'll either be New North or Barnstable, but either way, it'll be a great match. All right, well, let's uh, let's see what happens. You know, yep. we know what Barnstable's like. No idea about New North, so nope. we don't know which one to go for. Nope. So for Mike DeRosian and Tom Tings, this is Steve Sweetapple, and we'll see you on Saturday.